what you got good in there. <laughs> got some sausage balls. Sausage balls. And them little weenies. Mm. Like potted meat. <laughs> All right. We're Facebooking it right now. Good morning. We're streaming live from WAC TV 24 in Oxford, Alabama, around the world, and in and out. Oh, way over there. And, and uh, YouTube, Facebook, so China, we all wait over to China. Botswana. China. Botswana. Mm hmm. Africa. Uh, Alaska. The Swahili. Yeah. Everybody wake up now. We're about getting ready for TV. Just kind of laid back here discussing everything. We got sausage balls in the back. Miss Jenny brought us some sausage balls and and pigs in a blanket. We won't have to go to breakfast, will we? No. Save that breakfast few dollars. Breakfast is right there for us. Save that dollar. Save that. But, uh, my, my, my. Streaming live. I don't know why I ain't figured out what streaming is. I mean, you know, you just stream on it. Is it a string that goes up? A stream of I don't data. Know. Data. Yeah, what is data? data. What like is what is data? Data is information. Yeah. Digital information. Uh huh. Hmm. Well, yeah. I, I think that's what it is. Uh, How'd you get <laughs> so smart? <laughs> I'm, I'm wondering that myself. You got professor. I, I went to the professor. Jethro Bodine School of <laughs> School of uh, Hard Knocks. They can cipher. 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 Jeff Rowe wanted to be a double alt agent, wasn't he? A double yeah. alt spy. Yeah, double alt spy. Double alt seven, maybe yeah. double alt spy. That's triple alt seven is what I am. Uh, Five minutes, I heard that. Came all the oh, way from Oxford. Uh, <clears throat> I'm a <clears throat> getting throat cleared up there. That's the information. Y'all need to wake up. Ready for our... Uh, TV, we get a wake-up call every morning at 5.30. Yeah, boy. Hope everybody has Careful. a blessed day today. It's supposed to be good weather today. The rot was nice and cool, but it was dry this morning. The weather rock. Never wrong. Never. It's always a rock. Always a rock. That's oh, cool. I watched the Andy so, Griffith last night, y'all, that for the one where I where Aunt B's water got spiked and she's in that piano drunk playing like this, <laughs> bouncing up and down, feeling all right. It was so good. Aunt B. I think well, Otis or somebody, I can't afford her. Well, yeah, Otis is always one that pours it into the water. Well, water. that's what my buddy told me the other day. He said that everybody on Andy Griffith, the whole show, everybody on the show was single except for Otis. He was the only one married and he stayed drunk every day. No wonder. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Otis just let him say Everybody else out of was jail. sober. Everybody else sober. He stayed drunk. Every day. <laughs> My character was Ernest T, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh how I love you, Mrs. Riley. <laughs> <laughs> you want to dance? <laughs> I like it when he got cursed and had to tell Barney had to ride the horse down Main Street backwards. <laughs> <laughs> Get rid of that curse. That's what you gonna have to do. He wanted, wanted one of them uniforms. Uh, yeah. He throw them rocks at oh, the windows, yeah. breaking Knocking windows. windows out. That's what they do in the hood. Quit throw throwing them rocks, Ernestine. He said, "Ear take name. <laughs> ear take, <laughs> ear take name." <laughs> Hello to you and you. It's me. It's me. It's Ernestine. <laughs> Three minutes. If I'd have known you was coming, I'd have known what to do. I'd have thrown both arms up and wove at you. <laughs> and wove at you. <laughs> I don't chew my cabbage twice. <laughs> you know, he was the writer of all those. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yes, sir. He wrote all those episodes. Every one of them. Well, that's Ernest, interesting. You ain't seen the last of Ernest C. Banks. Andy Griffith. I thought he said, you want to dance? Yeah, you know, I heard it. Dance. Andy, Andy dance. was hard to get along with. I don't know if he was or not in real life. I don't know. I don't know. Somebody was telling me that. Was Andy Griffith? Yeah. He didn't seem like it. He didn't seem that way, did he? Mm. No. Good record. No, Judge Laird's got the, got the, I think his is the original. He's a 
copy of the, the police car. I think, he, I think he got one of the original. I think he did, yeah, from the movies. The police, the little black and white. Front there black and white, yeah. 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 And uh, he still got it. I think it's in the. I think they're doing a paint job on it right Them now. Them dang old cars, they, they weighed about four tons each. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. That was heavy old cars. That's good cars, oh. man. Oh, yeah. Best. Thanks. When you hit something with them, they got hit. Yes. <laughs> now, Tim Conway there was a comedian. Man. Oh, my God. He'd have old Harvey Corman crying man. on live TV trying to make it through those skits. Mrs. <laughs> that was, that, that's Mrs. Mrs. Oh. Wiggins. <laughs> Come in here, Mrs. Wiggins. Like when he was that dentist and he kept hitting the parts of his body with that numb and stuff. Yeah. And <laughs> I love it when he was a dry cleaners man, real slow and just barely moving. Mm -hmm. I found a good dry cleaner this week over there over there in uh, Lincoln. Mm -hmm. That's something you don't see much anymore. Uh, and it was, it's really, really good, and they did a good job, and it was real nice. Clean. Mama's family. You remember Mama's there. family? Yep. Yeah. That was a good show. Yep. What was it? Mama's family. Oh man. Carol Burnett too, man. There's. Mm -hmm. I mean. That was the good old days, buddy. Yeah. That's when the world it. was in a lot better place than it is today. Jackie Gleason. No this woke John. stuff Norton. Norton. got us woke Norton. up. Yeah. A lot better days. Churches were good. We should, but don't forget, we got to go to church Sunday, and you guys want to go. We're going. She said, make sure you bring your guitar, Randall. Mm -hmm. So I know you're going to get to sing some at the church. I want them shouting in the aisles. I guess y'all go ahead and start One playing there. We're fixing to down. wake up. we got about 10 seconds for wake-up time. All right, let's get ready to wake up and go to work, all you folks, us, and y'all, y'all out there. Good morning. Time to wake up. The D4 Show coming live from Talladega, Alabama, by the way of Oxford, WACTV, streaming live streaming. Oh, yeah. Cherry Street Church of God this Sunday and gonna go over there. Talked to her uh, yesterday. Yes, sir. She's looking forward to it, and I told her we'd be there. She said, "Tell Randall bring his guitar." So you must have sang up there before. I, I hadn't sang there, but they've been where I've sang before. Okay. Constantly. What's the What's the preacher's name there, Brother John? Or he down here? Yeah. Uh, wait. Yeah. John Wait. Wait. Brother John, they say he's one of them hellfire and brimstone preachers. I'm looking forward to hearing it. I hope the spirit's flowing and Wayne jumps up and goes to running up and down the said I'm going to kick them shoes off and go crazy. And be flipping and every do juking and jiving. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be smelling in there if I kick them shoes off. That's well, all I'm going to tell them. Well, we got to <laughs> wash our feet. And what if they, have a, they might have a foot wash. You ever been to a foot washing, Randall? Yeah. Uh, you ever been to one, Wayne? I've never been to a foot washing. Oh, yeah, they have foot washings okay. in church. Yeah, you take. I mean, I wash my own. You ever been to one, George? No. Man, you, maybe I'll tell her she needs to have one that Sunday. Okay. They usually do that at night before you go to bed. You know, 
They wash feet so okay, you go. Like that movie Dumb and Dumber where they bring out the the the, the disc sander and the yeah. <laughs> grinder <toenails. laughs> grinders and. <laughs> But that is, they, they, you know, that's part. That's in the Bible too. Okay, quick so, washing. Yeah, they got a little pan. They warm water. And so, somebody in the church elders, they pray and for you and wash your feet. It's interesting. It's kind of good, really. I bet get it you down. Good. Get you I down to you earth. Know, yeah. All right, Randall, kick it off this morning. Do a little looking for love, y'all. Oh Lord, help me. One, two, three, four. <laughs> me too. You woke up. You yeah. remembered today. <laughs> I'm, going, I'm going to bed when I leave here today, too. I'm more out. All that weed eating. Uh, yes. No matter. I'm tired of weed eating. Okay. Me too. Tired and I ain't done yet. I guess I will have to go home and weed eat again. <laughs> One day. <laughs> it's 
If that, I need about a five gallons of weed killer. I see it. And just kill it all. All of it. I mean, you don't worry about weed eating no more. Well, I, 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 I'll buy it and come out and spray it. But that way you won't get in trouble. You won't know what the heck happened there. That's right. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. I don't know nothing. Diesel swear fuel to is cheaper, too. Man. Yeah, a lot cheaper. It works, too. Well, all right, Wayne, well, do us a song. i tell you what. First, let me invite and welcome my darling out there. We got a private chef right here, <laughs> y'all. I'm talking yes, about do. she brings in this food and uh, we destroy it as you can tell right there. Miss Jeannie, welcome you into the house with us today. Appreciate you. And your granddaughter, I'm sorry, I forget names there. I, I don't even know my own there. And Jeff, we do know him now. Yeah, we know him. Riley. Riley Miss Riley's, Riley's in here Riley. from South Alabama, I think it is, all the way up. Fairhope, Alabama. Fairhope, Alabama. Also warned. Now, you know, Casey and Pam, they were going to write this down and give it to me. Uh, they forgot like I forget names. But I do know that this lady is married to Spark Plug and Mr. Warren there. Call him Slick Willie. And a belated birthday, 39 years young there, and uh, we show sure love her to death. So, Warren... We've done it for her, not for you. We ain't talking to you other than saying roll tight to you. <laughs> so uh, we're going to do a little thing called Love Bug, bu uh, boys. And if, if Chris will pull that up for me there, and here's an old George Jones song that uh, George Strait recut there and had a recut on it. And, uh, it's called The Old Love Bug. Don't never let it bite you. Ooh, Lord, it, oh. When it does, buddy, it'll make you You start miss, obeying. Start, you start obeying. <laughs> you start missing. You start drinking wine, and you're missing your job. Yeah. <laughs> it, 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 that sick. love bug is something yeah. else now. Going to big parties. Oh, and... man. 17. 17. That's a big party now. We'll she might have felt like that was 17 there after drinking that one. <laughs> I believe I'd have been worn out, worn out too there, you know. Three more bottles of wine, two more bottles of wine. Love bug, let's see what we can do here, boys, if you would. About to kill A there. I hear it. Chicks to myself. Suddenly it happened. Funny little fairy night fell. Tried to outrun it, but it finally caught up with me. Tell me how can I run from something I can't see? Mr. Weed Eater. Here come Randall Warren. Well, I always thought that I had me a pretty good style. But I lost that race by a good old country mile. I was walking around. It all started with a little bitty kid. 
everybody on a Wednesday morning. Good to have you watching. All right. There you go. We got Sandra Sweeney, Lloyd Burns, and Benny Leverton all saying good morning and uh, checking in with us. Don Farmer said good morning. And y'all have a wonderful day. Brother Benny. And, and Jenny Sparks up there, our, our chef. She said, wrote us a note, said good morning, guys. May Lee, you remember May Lee? I sure do. May Lee Chuck, Con May Lee Connor. My, 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 May Lee. Said two favorite guys, we love you. That's talking about me and you. She ain't talking about y'all. No, no, two no, favorite. No, no. May Lee, we love you. Y'all know who we're talking about. We love you too. Sandy Flasher, good morning from live from Fayetteville, Georgia. And y'all have a blessed day. We're going to do a, a little golf song, a little precious memories. And All while right. we're getting ready for that, Wayne, it's going to be a beautiful day, beautiful day. The weather rock is at this I mean, it's just sparkling out there. Really well, I'll tell you what, since Easter, even Easter was a beautiful day. And every day after y'all get out there, it, it, he woke us up this morning, and we got up out that bed, and uh, he's letting us see another day. Dude. Yeah, and I hope it's beautiful weather when we go down to, where are we going? Gulf Shores. Gulf Shores. Yes, We're going to we do are. a couple of days from Gulf Shores Live. So. We're going to be something else now, putting mm, on them well, short we're pants. we're going to have on our shorts. Or my old tan. I ain't going to look shirts. pretty out there. Oh, yeah. Out on the beach out beach there. Beach whales. That's there. what we're going to be. Beach whales. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Around all my family and friends. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I wonder why Seen angels sing from somewhere to my soul. How they linger ever knew me and the sacred past and sing one for them? Let's take it easy one time, boys. Take it easy. Yes. That means don't take it too hard. Take it real easy. Well, I've been running down the road trying to loosen my load. I got seven women on my mind. 
I've been I've been coming in every morning, kind of sleepy and droggy, and I figured out how to. to I took me a trip last night, okay, and I put my airplane mode on on my phone, and that thing just quit ringing after that. that. Right hey, there. I got on that difference. plane and took me a ride, and nobody called, <laughs> and that there was you go. good. You know, people forget that you would get up at two o'clock in the morning, and uh, I'm so used to the nightlife, and they start calling at eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven thirty, twelve. So last night's the first time I done airplane mode, so if anybody called me, I hate it. You missed out on me. I was on that trip in that plane. <laughs> <laughs> so, George, you, you, uh, you want to uh, sing one? <laughs> or you want to play us a, a solo? <laughs> Kick off a good uh, and a little steel guitar <laughs> rag or something. Yeah. <laughs> that was so low we couldn't hear it, George. Do that again. There you go. <laughs> I like George. Oh, George has been with us a long time. We we, yes. we found some of our old tapes that we did. We had back years ago. We fixed to put them on CD. And we, we maybe we show some of those or DVD or uh, thumb drive or something. Maybe we show some of those for one day and take a and you take a and, day uh, off. George, Travis, Travis, Wilson, Wilson yeah, all of them, and Mark. Mark was on drums with us. Back yeah, then. Oh, Mark, David Cook, and yes. all the old guys. I there. remember David boy. He was, getting, he was getting down one morning. Yeah, he did. <laughs> down yonder playing Dale Woods. Down, there, you know, down. Jumping up and down. Da, 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 da. Yeah, remember that, down George? Yonder. Yeah, he did. All right, George, play us something this morning. Yeah. This is a little the instrument here, guys. Y'all have some fun with it.
Yes. I'm going fast. Yeah. yeah. A little slow there, Joe. Well, you know. Sorry. Slow it down a little bit, Joe. Yeah. Uh, he, he got his mixture right this morning, boy. He's swinging him. Boy, boy. I'm telling you what, this man still is. I can't even Took breathe off. right now. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know, steel players they don't get much recognition, and and uh, not many of them sing. There was one guy that sang and fronted the band. What was his name? He, he played the casinos, played for us in Panama. He'd come in and jam with us in Panama City. What was his man, name? I forget, D. But uh, Dad Gummy. He's got his own band. Yeah, yeah You remember yeah. George? Who that guy is? No, no. Dad he, Gummidge, he didn't throw one on. And he's a big name. He plays yeah. all the casinos, oh, yeah, man. Yeah. And does it. He's the front man. He sits right out front and right. sings and, and right. leads the band. And boy, he's a good one. And uh, I, I Joe, I'm gonna tell you what. If I was wow. using both feet, both knees, and both hands, I don't think I could sing either. Yeah, yeah. and every finger, you know. You every know. finger, man. That's that's the reason George twitches a lot. Though. Yeah, you got a little he twitch. Walks around, got a little <laughs> twitch about it. Don't really know which way to go. All right, Randall, yeah. sing us another song. All righty. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Um, Mary Funderburk called in and said, good morning, uh, Funderburk. Sounding good. Jack Brown, good morning, everybody. All right. Have a good day. Jean Sparks said hello and, and it sounds great again back there. She's enjoying the live performance. She's excited. Right here with She's us. She's right here with us. Mom, brother, I, I snuck one of those uh, uh, sausage balls in on y'all. I, I stayed with the pigs in the blanket. Pigs in the blanket. Yeah, yeah. Janice Ferguson, good morning. One of my favorite. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That we appreciate that. Randall Sing is a beautiful. Uh, hey, whatever you want to sing, do something exciting. Don't be slow. Slow. After that, oh, you got to slow. Nice too. I got to slow down a little bit. To it I try. Let's do an old uh, Billy Joe Royal. Then I'm not thinking. Uh -oh. Oh, in the key of F, and it's just easy. Wow. Just not working. We both know for some time. That old fire's been out for so long. We just stop trying.
Randall Warren. Good job, Randall. Thank you, thank you. Yes, sir. You know, uh, Wayne, we forgot, really. Warren is in the hospital this morning with knee surgery. You know that is right, up in uh, Anniston, I think. Right, he's doing it in Anniston, and... Uh, that's, that's called Sparky and Slick Willie and yeah. Warren. You got three Warren, names. You got three of them there. Well, we hope him the best. Knee surgery, isn't it? Or hip? Uh, knee, I think. Knee. Yeah, having a and, knee, uh, whole knee replacement. Over, yeah. And he's a. Uh, he likes Mustang Sally, so I'm gonna do that. Yeah. He, he ain't gonna be dancing this morning. They're probably getting ready to start it about right now. Warren, I know you're not awake. I don't think, but they can tell you about it. So we're gonna do a little Mustang Sally for Warren oh. Slick Willie. <laughs> Spark plug, spark plug. Warren. The Mustang Sally. Oh, yeah. Yes, you better slow the Mustang down. Oh, uh, hear me talking now. All right. The Mustang Sally. Yes, you better slow your Mustang down. Better slow it on down. You've been running all over town, baby. I guess you had to put your flat feet right on the ground. All right. All right, all you folks out there at home right now. All you want to do is ride around Sally, ride, Sally, ride. All you want to do is ride around Sally, ride, Sally, ride. All you want to do is ride around Sally, ride, Sally, ride. Oh, yeah, yeah. And all you want to do is ride around Sally.
But he get on out of that bed and come home. And when you send that out to him and Bulldog again. Yeah, old Bulldog, that's right. He yeah. barks at us every morning. Every morning he'll be barking. All right, Wayne, do us another song. I tell you what, let's slow it down and get a request that we had uh, last week, I think it was, from Gene Watson. And we're going to do a little farewell party there, boys. And uh, no modulation because it's so early, so we'll just stay uh, <laughs> We'll stay right with the old uh, root, yeah, root note you. there. there. Uh, what, what key are we doing in, George? A D, isn't it? I think it is. E. E? Okay, let's do it, D. Are we doing D? Well, it yeah. wouldn't hurt. Let's do it. Let's do it in D. Early, oh, early boy, morning. Boy, thank you. you. We'll just stay there, too. Here we go. When the last breath of life is gone, from my body and my lips are as cold as the sea. When my friends gather round for my farewell party. That's an old sad song. Had me crying. Boy, I tell you what now. 
I forgot who was. Might have been Doyle or one of them uh, last week wanted some Gene Watson. So that's yeah. about as Gene as you want to get. Oh, right Gene, was, Gene was sad. Oh, man. he was sad. That's the now. one they all Farewell ask for. Farewell party, boy. That's the one they all die yeah, for? That's the one they ask for. Oh, okay. That's it. <laughs> My favorite one they ever done is that when a man can't get a woman off. Oh, oh man. he tears that one. Oh. Oh, <laughs> And what, what did they tell him? And <laughs> sitting down, he hit that note, too, you know. He's... What a monster singer. Yep. Yes. Sir. Still. Uh, he yeah. was sad, though. Oh, sad as you can get. <laughs> Farewell. Uh, Bye. The dog was even dead. Yeah, that was yard. it. Yeah. <laughs> sad as you can get and keep on living, huh? <laughs> you get no sadder than that. Uh, they just died and get no sadder than that. <laughs> All right, Willie, uh, let's, let, let's, let's, let's uh, let your tonsils up. backfire this oh, morning. Okay, there, I'll show them. Let's do uh, some Buck Owens this morning. Speed it up just a little bit. There you go. Yeah, just Not little. too fast. Don't take I know. off now. <laughs> Slow down. <laughs> See, Chris already knows. Well, I don't care if the sun don't shine, and I don't care if the bells don't chime, just as long as you love me. Well, I don't care if the top don't spin. I don't care if the gin don't gin Just as long as you love me So darling, let it rain, let it snow Let the cold north wind blow Just as long as you love me North to south, east to west You know I will stand the test the horses today are you no nope. y'all kind of wait let it have it when it wants to it's supposed to be having a, a baby uh randall's having a child and there's <laughs> 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 a baby pony i thought she just wanted to stay at home and watch the horse thank you for three weeks she's been watching that horse for three weeks i told me to have it when it's ready and y'all can't rush it up i don't think no i didn't even look in on her this morning she'll probably be there probably have when it. you get right. back it's probably running out in the pasture and stuff just kicking up and having a good time Probably hearing these songs. A pony. Put <laughs> <laughs> your hand up in there and <laughs> drag it on out. <laughs> All right, Phil, sing us a song. Hey, let's have a little fun with some Highway 40 blues if you got that, Chris. We'll get George going on this. And I know I've had them Highway 40 blues. I, I, you know that farewell party, though? That was Tyler Smith's favorite song that you did back oh, in really? the day at the show, pal. He used to talk about Wayne and Lord tear that Tyler. farewell party Is up. Tyler still living? As far as I know, out yeah. in Reno. Reno. Uh, yeah. You squall. I like that day he did the grand tour, and when he got done, he said, oh, and he said, yes, you took the baby, and went on talking about something else. <laughs> <laughs> she took the child. Yes, yeah, she took, took the, the baby, baby and went well, on there. We're having a big show tomorrow. <laughs> That's bad. That's bad. He wasn't crying. <laughs> no. Go ahead. <laughs> Time for her to go. Uh, Count George. Three, four, one. Well, these Highway 40 blues, I've walked holes in both my shoes. 
Count of days since I've been gone And I'd love to see the lights of home A waste of time and money too I squandered youth in search of truth But in the end I had to lose Lord above I paid my dues I got the highway for the blues The highway car when I was young Told me lies of things to come Fame and fortune lies ahead That's what the billboard lies had said Shattered dreams my mind is numb My money's don't stick out my thumb My eyes are filled with bitter tears Lord, I ain't been home in years I got the highway for Sing us another song. I <laughs> yeah. Okay. He's got it. them Highway 40 blues. We got I'm the not, ending. I know, and I'm still in <laughs> shock over that. So I was like, wow, we did it. We, we got the ending right on that. Archie said he could take off on it any time after all these years still. I believe him. He you needs know, to bring his tail up here one morning and play. Yeah, I know. He's believe. in town. He's in town Is working he in with town? him. Yeah. Talk him in there, that drag him in here. He said morning. he wants to, him and Mackenzie want to come up and do the show. Well, come on, She's man. a great singer. She comes to the club sometimes. Yeah, we've tried somewhere. to get her to come sing some with us. She's but liable to. She needs to. She's a good singer. Yeah. Let's do some uh, more George Strait, y'all. Like, uh, if you want a stranger, come on home. Yes, sir. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Been showing all the signs of a woman with someone else on her mind. Is not you for the nights I've left you alone? If you're thinking you want a stranger. There's one coming home If you're thinking you want a stranger I'll soon be there You're gonna see a change in me This time I swear you silk gown and perfume today picked up some roses and champagne all the way I called to ask you to put some soft music on if you're thinking you want a stranger there's one coming home 
Chip shots that just can't beat that steel guitar, George. Man, great great yeah. job, George. Uh, Janice Sperg said, my sister Anne Marie Barksdale loves Billy Joe Rowan. This is great. Debbie Dow said, good morning. Santa Sweener said, y'all can play, can y'all play Happy Birthday, darling? Remember that song? Yeah, but I don't know. I don't know it. I don't, Randall, I don't know. She picks him hard, but I think she oh, does yeah. that on purpose. Who is she that? Does. Sandra. Oh, Sandra yeah. Swain. Yeah. Uh, Janice Ferguson said, Wayne Hand, you, you got me crying in my coffee. I'm man. crying in my coffee. I'm not sitting on the bar. So <laughs> laugh out loud. That's what's great. And That's let's see. Good. What else? We got people calling in. Lori Burns said, good morning from Doyle and Lori. Sounding great. So thank y'all. Thank y'all. And uh, so we're getting a lot of calls. <laughs> and uh, having a good morning, just kind of relaxing today and playing some music. You know, we started the show out as uh, just playing – we're bringing, co putting country back in country. And I think that they're going to use my slogan there, Wayne, up in they, most of the shows. I believe they are. They're going to do it. And speaking of Doyle and Lori, I'm looking forward to them going up maybe to right. most of the shows with us. Next coming week. Up next week there. And uh, they did. Uh, Jeff, we were talking to Jeff and them, and uh, he likes that put the country back in the, the country. country. I think and that's the slogan they're going to use. Right, up there. I think so. And uh, Randall said that, that that good old real country. Don't music. play, don't say classic. That makes you think. Yeah, I like oh, real I country. Ain't singer and stuff. Just yeah. real country music. It's just real country music. And George Jones said it right there on the stage. We're going to play some real, real country. country music. So. They were talking about Alan Jackson yesterday. Uh -huh. Him and Travis Tripp both got kicked out of Nashville for their songs about country ain't right. country anymore. Right. right. Murder down on. That music was George Road. Strait. Yeah, George. And I Alan was up Jackson. there when they had that murder on Music Row. Uh -huh. Good song. Yeah. Then they refused. Killed song. country music. And they didn't used to play it. They didn't try to blame me for that. No. <laughs> you didn't kill <laughs> country music. They didn't get that, did they? <laughs> no. You promoted it. <laughs> I promote country. So we, yep. you know, I didn't get into country, what, the 90s, I guess it was. I was in the rock and roll in Atlanta and Columbus all back in those days. Boy, when, they, City. when you called it. Everybody thought she was crazy. Well, and I said did too. I went crazy. Wayne said, but "Man, you don't do Ford that." Ford going yeah. country. He said, "And I was country. packed every night." You were bringing in good crowds there. Yeah. Now, now you had to add that rock and roll to pay our pay for the country. It had to put in the bar. <laughs> we were we downstairs. just kept the party going. That's all you ever done. Did it you? paid and, uh, for the party. You kept going on and kept on partying and do the same thing there in Lincoln. There, you can pass by there six or seven. Could be packed. Could be packed. <laughs> it could be, but uh, everybody's behaving good up there too. And we got uh, good. we got Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturday nights right there. House play. Oh, by the way, house playing Thursday a single, so y'all can hey, relax hey, Thursday. Yo, night. He's that might be a good everybody. practice day. You know? We're talking about country, though. You can put the countryest person in the world on stage, and uh, the songs that they do, and the way they do them, they're up there singing rap music with a Southern accent that don't make it country, no, no. at all. No, I mean, and, and most the of the ones, twitch or and most of them that are singing country, even trying to sound country, you can tell it's put on. It's just yep. going on. well, you know. I told this guy, I ain't gonna tell you who it was, but I told this <laughs> DJ around here on uh, Alabama 100 that uh, they was but <laughs> one country singer he in the state of Alabama. Though. And that was Mr. Wayne yeah, Hand. Yeah, he boy. got upset with me. But, you country know, is corn, bro. Country is country. I <laughs> yeah. told him, I said, you younger guys, y'all had to get in front of a mirror and protect us how to you twist man, well, your well, mouth well, over there. Oh, well, country. <laughs> so That was another true story, too. We've told it two or three yeah. times. But the guy come in in the club that night and yeah. talking about getting <laughs> squalling now. And he walked up to Dean. He said, can that old boy do any old Old, old country. He's also about good old old crying so, country. So I they, said, you got he it. He come up there and he said, I want you to strap it on. <laughs> and I strapped it on from he stopped loving her today. <laughs> Finally, he done He was collapsed. sitting there like this when yeah. he started. He got down. <laughs> he, 
I just can't stand it. He said, I love that country music. That old boy about to kill me. I've lost my wife. I'm going to ask her for a divorce when I leave here. He wouldn't even see it. He really did. It was funny. It was right at the end of the night. Yeah. And he, he said, you know, I love his country music. Can he get some other crying country out there? I said, he should. Oh, yeah. I said, you talked to the right one. I wonder. I said, why ain't this fellow back here want some old country? Country, old crying country. He heard him. After five songs, he was almost in the floor. He was sitting up straight, <laughs> just getting lower and lower. He, and lower. Was, he was collapsed <laughs> on down. He just like, had enough. I can't stand it. He said, I can't take no more. But, oh, uh, that's good stuff. That's what it's all about, though, D. Oh, we right. got a guy, and I, and I the left the notes back there in the back. We got a guy coming uh, next Thursday, and he'll make, he'll make you and Wayne look slim. Y'all feel real slim. And this guy's wrote a good song, good country singer. And he's wrote a song about Muscle Shows in Nashville, and uh, how Muscle Shows is going. It's putting the sound back into Pretty country well, music. Yeah. And he wrote it at the right time. It's really a good song. Really good song. I don't know if y'all heard it or not. She played it for me yesterday. And he can play and sing. He does a lot on the beach. Maybe y'all seen him down there. I don't know. But I think he's coming all up here from Florida. I think so. And uh, boy, he did sound good, too. Man, he, he sounded he good a, and wrote a great song. Yep. So we're looking forward. We appreciate all the guests that's come. We got a, another guy coming in from uh, from Nashville, truck driver. Truck there, driver, so yeah. He wants to do country. And, uh, you in the right. But well, first, he wanted to do his tapes. But uh, no, I told him he was perfect. Said, nah, I said, just let the old band just. And he said, well, can they play country? He said, man, please. Come on up, come on up here, come and be on. with us. You know. So he's coming down. He's coming up. We got, Cecil, some, we Cecil, got, we got Skyler up. coming back. Friday. Skyler will be back this Friday. Y'all remember old Skyler, old redhead there? And Boy, she was getting a ball of fire now. I, I tell you what, she felt it. Yep, yes, she did, and still does it. Does it uh, every weekend, playing somewhere and all over the southeast and everywhere. So, so we got some good guests coming on, and. Uh, we just, we're putting the, the gospel back in the gospel, southern gospel and all that good stuff. And George has got to go to work. Say you didn't have to so. leave us, George. I told you to beg your boss off out of 30 minutes. <laughs> I bet I bet $100 he'd do it. Well, you could just stay an extra hour at the end of the day, George. Right? Yeah, oh, yeah. 30, 30 minutes here. Yeah. Trade that out. George wants y'all to help him uh, bring him something to drink in the welfare line. Then. <laughs> George knew like I did when I worked phone company. If I showed up late, I'd just leave thirty minutes early to wait <laughs> make up for it. <laughs> oh, oh, what a pleasure there! I tell you what. Who will sing one? I got one. I'm gonna uh, spring yeah. on them, you know. Uh -oh. Spring something new. I'm gonna spring it on Willie. Me and, me and Phil used to do this on a lot. So it's called Velvet Chains. Oh, Gary Morris song. Oh, Gary Morris. He'll Good singer. Like He'll know it. Ready there? Play Here we go. Song, really. <laughs> Sometimes we teach you. That we have to learn the songs as we go. As we, as we go. Song. He can play anything. I'll teach him to Willie real quick. He already knows it. So I just thought it. Velvet Chain song. Ah. Uh -huh. 
the door wide open You don't like me I come and go You never ask me where I've been You know I'm faithful Yes, I'm bound to be Your loving arms Held these velvet chains on me Velvet chains Bill sing us another one. Well, let's see. What do I want to do? Let <laughs> Dunny well, Bellamy, brother, speaking of me and Randall, what, what you going to say, dude? Go ahead. That's why I said do a good Bellamy, brother. Yeah. <laughs> Randall's talking about things we used to do. We used to appear as the Bellamy brothers from time to time. <laughs> yeah. anyway, well, that, we always used to say, you know, if you ever seen me and Phil and the Bellamy brothers in the room at the same time? No. No. So, you know. <laughs> Conspiracy. There's a lot of conspiracy <laughs> theories out there, you know. Long blonde hair, sky blue eyes. Yeah, that well-fed look is easy to recognize. Tailored dress fits so.
telling me, brothers, man, I, that's, that's, that's a good group. That's a good song. Yes. Been a while. They had a few. Yeah, a bunch of them. Yeah. Florida boys is what mm. they are. All the way. Mm, that's where we're going. We're going to be down that way. Well, actually, we're going to be in Gulf Shores. Gulf Shores, Alabama. Yeah, that's about as good. Same beach. Same yeah. beach. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Same beach right there. Rest side beside each other. Why ain't you ready to do another one? Let's do Set em Up, Joe. We ain't done that one in a long, long time. Come Smoke Burn Gosling. If you'll fix Come me up there, with Chris. <laughs> We hadn't done in a while here. Good Set to get them up, out there. Joe. What we got, D? Uh, uh, Jay said Murder on Music Row. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a good That's one. Chad Ford and Samantha Brown said good morning, everyone. Good morning. Samantha? Yes. Good, good morning, good morning. You know, we time's flying this morning. We're doing a lot of good music, a lot of different music. Just hope you're enjoying it. And uh, reminded us, see, Eight Track Entertainment's having some big, and most of the shows having some big announcements up there. Uh, the twenty second, they got a lot of stuff happening in most of the shows, and they're showing the way in country music right now. Shannon Doors uh, kicking butt up there, and, and uh, it's going to be a good weekend. It's, I think it's the hundredth year anniversary of uh, most of the shows, sixtieth year anniversary of uh, Fame Studios, and then the rebirth of. Uh, muscle show. This it's all happening. A lot of big stuff. I think I'm gonna get a gold record, Wayne. I'll be excited. I ain't never even seen one, let, let alone have one. Well, you'll move on up to platinum Man, right quick yeah, too. Platinum too. Coming by you. Christmas, I think. So. D, y'all gained a, a great artist and a good, oh, man, good, yes. good fella and one of the finest singers, Mr. Ronnie Millsap. Yes. Now I don't know if it's the writers that's got a couple of his tunes that he's know. cutting or how they cut. I don't know. But I do know that they're bringing him in the studio right there at Fame yeah. and. Uh, so good old Ronnie Millsap. It'll be good to get a release. Now, I do know for a fact that they're in the studio with Miss Tanya Tucker. Tanya Tucker. There's another name that I hadn't heard in years. Bring it back some of the old country. Well, that's, that's what it is, man. The that's real what it's country. About. Real it's just country. The, 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 the country music that, that we 
love and, and, and remember more so than any of them. I you know, know the, you and Jerry, uh, both, uh, even though y'all were in rock and roll, and I still Jerry did love but country. I tell you what, y'all done some of the finest, the old release me days, and, uh, yeah. and, and, and I love the Ray Price song that you do. Uh, what was that? All that's that's that stuff. Man, I, I did a Ray Price song. Oh, you've done some Ray Price uh, the, 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 uh, for the good times. For the good times. Yeah, one we could the, do that. One, I wish you would because it's one of my favorite. But all those standards that y'all done. Uh, I, I did that in the rock and roll world. I know Mary, uh, your, your wife there, she uh, – Five five hundred miles away from home, and I thought yeah. nobody, you know, knew oh, yeah. that and stuff. And, and we'd go down the road, and I said, "Well, oh, Dave, he was raised. He had that silver spoon and city slicker Shoot. stuff. Man, played I'm so poor I couldn't pay attention now. But y'all listen to some good old country music, gospel music all no, your I life. Was raised, you know? I was taught raised to use choir and church. Choir. And, uh, I could move. It. They taught me how to move my hand. But know? I knew, I knew <laughs> when you, I knew when you flipped him a. Uh, Overalls out. There's going to be a little rock and roll involved. No <laughs> doubt about it. I got that. to bring that picture up. I want to have it enlarged it right here. You Four years old, it. I think. But it's simply because of the old times, the old way. You know, when you took a picture, you didn't smile. Nobody. Nobody did. smiled other than, other than you. There was something going on that day. I don't I know. I going to tell you what. But, but I you know. had that little old head. You don't look so Do sad. I know it's over, but life goes on in this old world. We'll keep on turning. Let's just be glad we had some time to spend together. There's no need to watch the bridges that were burning. So lay your head upon my pillow and hold. of the raindrops blowing salt against the window you make me leave you love me one more time for the good time I'll get along And you'll find another And I'll be here If you should find You ever need me Don't say a word About tomorrow Forever, there'll be time enough for sadness when you leave me. So lay your head upon my pillow and hold your. Hear the whisper of the raindrops blowing songs against the window. And make believe you love me one more time for the good time. For the 
You know, job. you're talking about Good rock and roll and R&B and all that stuff. And I was saying, oh, Dwight Smith is a drummer friend of mine. I'm like, we need to try to get in touch with Dwight. He's probably with Engelbert. I haven't been able to get in touch with him. Yeah. And uh, Engelbert uh, was his big, best gig he ever had, but he played with Glenn Fry for a long time, and Aretha Franklin, and Cameo, and all kinds of stars, and D. Ford. He played with us for a long time. <laughs> played even played here in Aniston and when I first came over here. And uh, Dwight went to Vegas to see him out there, and he carried me back to back and introduced me to everybody in the band and everything. He said, this is the guy that taught me how to play drums. And it kind of surprised me. He said, well, he didn't teach me how to play drums. He taught me how to play different styles of music. He said, I only knew one style when he hired me. That was the old Towns and the Drifters, what they call it, beach music, I guess. And that's what he was doing, and he was good at it. And But I did it. I was doing rock and roll. We were doing R&B, and I'd throw, so, throw some stuff in like that, My Way, Impossible Dream, and yeah. So when he went with them guys, he knew exactly what to do. And he said, I really taught him how to play drums. And I guess eh, the styles of music, I guess, what taught him. But Dwight Smith, check him out played. sometime. We played. Played we played. We played. <laughs> we yeah. played seven nights a week. We played yeah, and we played and we that's, played some more. That's what it, that's what it takes. You I started at nine and we quit at four. You know, we had a good time. You gotta put in seven in days. Gotta put in they were married to the club, you know. They all got married at the club. No, yep. I'm just kidding. That's where they could meet the women. That's where they had to get married. No, it was, it was a good he day. came up and sat in with us one night, and uh, I forgot who we had to uh, play. Uh, Adrian. Adrian, that's Adrian. what it was. And Wilson and Randy and all the guys said, Adrian, go ahead and take, just take, take the rest, rest of the night <laughs> off. Here, you know. What a pleasure it was with Jay Scott and guys like that. Yeah. And that's what it was. They're, they're players. Right. Trust me. They that's play, they play they music. They play music. But you give them a variety of, right. of different songs and different people, country as I was or whoever, and rock and roll or what, whatever the gospel or whatever we were playing. When I hired Chuck on bass, Chuck was, Same he way. was playing in a rock and roll R&B band. Never had I, He said he never even heard of country. He'd heard of it, but he didn't never played it. And I said, uh, I need a bass player down in Panama City. He said, well, okay, let's go. And I, I said, it's country music. Do you, do you know how to play it? He said, it's music, ain't it? I said, yeah. He said, music is numbers. If it's music, I can play it. So yeah, uh, how many did. songs was it, huh? He can. He can. Yeah, okay. seven, 74. 74 that, songs that in one night, night I think, yeah. he would play. He actually uh, learn, learn them as we went. Yeah, he, he charted a little bit, just some there. But, man, when you was around them guys like Jay and all of us and Duke. Well, he's and one of like you guys, man. He's, yeah. he's one of those guys that knew where to go. Music's yeah. got a certain, you know, it's numbers and a certain way it's got to go, basically. And he said, if it's if it's music, I can play it. And he did. And he did. And, uh, we tried to call him to work on the show, but he done got old and lays on his mama's couch. And, <laughs> and old and lazy and probably still in that wine. He loves that wine. Yeah. So Chuck's so quiet and everything, talks com- good you. when, he's, when he's sober. But boy, you get him on that wine, he'll, he'll Eat talk. You up. <laughs> <laughs> he'll talk. Eat you up. I think it's funny about Dwight that, his jerry curl caught on fire, oh, yeah. and he was screaming for water to pour on his head, and somehow from that, Chris ended up being called Waterhead. Waterhead. Yeah, Shouldn't right. Dwight have been Waterhead yeah. since his jerry since curl his, was on fire? Yeah. I, I never understood that, Chris. And that was done way before Michael Jackson it, it was, and Pepsi yeah, and all that. Yeah, Jackson yeah. on that. He oh, had him thousand watt part. I mean, they were this close to it. <laughs> but now they had him up there. He has a lot to do with that, but you'd heard enough. Well, he, he always said, I need light. to be more in the spotlight. I need to be more in the spotlight. He want to be a front Hair man. Light. Yeah. He want to be a front man. He said, I'm going to be a front man. I said, well, you can, okay. but right now you're going to play drums. So he kept saying, I need more light. So he was singing a song, and it was a thousand watt part. They were about 10 inches from his head. I walked around and said, Chris, turn them lights on bright. <laughs> and he hit him right on his head. Next thing you know, steam was coming off. Water! Water, and Chris thought he's water calling his head. name. <laughs> Waterhead, water come on, Waterhead. <laughs> so Another good one, too, when y'all put the light in the uh, the guy that was so jealous about his wife oh, and yeah. girlfriend. Y'all hit him in the face with it. He yeah. couldn't see it. Yeah, he, he it was three, mi- three military guys were standing in front of her, and she was up on the balcony right behind him. And they wasn't talking to her at all, but he couldn't see her. Oh, uh, well, Chris, you remember his name? I can't Mitch Falk. <laughs> Mitch Falk, boy, and he was... He was on stage, and we had these thousand-watt pars across the front of the stage. And, and so Chris put that one in his eyes, and he, was, he moved over. 
I said, get the next. He put the next one. He kept moving over, moving over, moving <laughs> over, and finally he fell off the stage. <laughs> Trying to watch his girlfriend. <laughs> Sugar Bear it's, fell off the stage up there one time, broke his leg, and yeah. never missed a note. The yeah, guys just stood him up. Kept playing. <laughs> He's probably doing the same thing, looking at his old leg. Probably. <laughs> Trying to keep his eyes on him. He jumped around a lot. Who yeah. was that? Sugar, Sugar Bear. You know, I, oh, I, yeah. Sugar Bear, I told Wayne about Sugar Bear. He walked I've the never, whole time. You remember never that? Never met him. Mm-hmm. He walked the whole time he was playing. He just, his yeah. feet and legs and whatever whatever speed he was playing, that was a, his walk was <laughs> that speed, you know. And, he uh, flew him in on an airplane. He had on a suit and had his base. He was, that's all he needed. Yep. He could play. Fire. Yeah. Where did, is, he, is Sugar Bear still living? I, th- I don't know. Anybody heard from him? I haven't seen him in a long time. You know, that's when uh, uh, Dwight, Dwight he, he wanted to be a star. So I had him up here at the club and asked, boy, they, we were knocking him out. Mm-hmm. He talked all of them to leave, and he wanted to go on the road. How long did they last, Chris? Two weeks. <laughs> I think they went out on the road lasted two weeks. They split up after that. They had a good job, good paying job, boy, and Dwight. Man, we don't need these. We don't need this. We don't need that. So said, well, y'all go then. No y'all hit the road. Yes. Two weeks later, they all come home. And oh, I bet. Beg it. Start it over. <laughs> uh, Santa says, Santa Swin said, I'm glad y'all started this morning's show. I get up at, uh, at 5 every, every morning and a lot look forward to hearing that y'all sing. It just makes the day go better. Thank and you. Thank you. Thank you, Santa. We appreciate that. Anyway, that was some of the stories of the old days, and we're about to run out of time here. Anybody want to talk, sell anything? I like hearing them stories. <laughs> we like got a, we got millions of them one of these days. I think we're gonna do a lot of that when we're done, and we're going down to we're gonna do a Thursday, a Friday, and a Saturday, and we're gonna go deep sea fishing, and we're gonna have a chef out there cooking for us. We're gonna do our show streaming live through WEAC TV 24 here in Oxford, Alabama. We'll be in. And on the beach down there, Gulf Shores. I got it right this time. You got it right, and Gulf I got to get the uh, the the rooms, the condos name that he's. Yeah, got we got to do this. He's got a sure room. It's, it's a little villas, man, place. and it's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. They just finished remodeling, built it. It's nice. Got a big swimming pool right on the beach. Man, we might move out on the beach we'll on some. a Saturday day or something and do a little show yeah. out there on the beach. Just. Have some fun. We want people, to, stuff want people to come in off the street and, and sing and talk with, to us and uh, just have a good time. And, and uh, I know Joel Chapman and his wife and a bunch of them from uh, Panama City used to come out with yeah, us. They're going to come out. And they're coming out and going there. And we might even get old James Finch to stop by. You I, I think I might run over and watch his uh, son race there tonight in, in uh, Pensacola. Pen- Pensacola. Yeah. Uh, he he races. I didn't know if it was his guy. It is it's his, his son. son, yes. Joel you know, goes over there. You know, I hadn't seen James in probably 35 years since they were racing out here at uh, the Talladega Speedway, him and, and uh, you know, who uh, one of, uh, of Brad Keselowski was driving for James Prince. That was a long story. Uh, he won the, his race out at Talladega in James Finch's car, and Dale Earnhardt Jr. put that deal together. He called James. He said, he said, he said, he said, he Dale called uh, James. He knew James real well. Said, Brad Kozlowski has lost his job. Can you furnish him a car for the race? He said, yeah. So they went out there and won the race. And that's, Is that that's the how first James, time he drove for James? Yeah. Wow. So that's, he won the race at the wow. Tile Dickens. So that was good out there. James deserved it, and so did the Oh, James is a great guy, man. I remember when he didn't, Boy. when he was just starting out in the business. He got to business. He got in the business the way, the way I understand it. He was working for a man that remodeled the Panama Canal. Back, I think it was back in the early 70s, right in there when they redid the canal. And uh, James was working with this man. He had bid the job, and the man had told him, he said, I'm going to sell you the company one of these days. So he sold James the company, and they hadn't got the bid yet. And he sold the company. And as soon as they sold it, James got the, they got the company. So he made millions on his first job. And he's a super nice guy. He didn't forget where he come from. He's just he's a nice get him, the gentleman out there. Still racing around the country, sponsored everybody. Well, I know this, D. Uh, you know way more about racing than, yeah. than, than I do. But as far as, and, and, and as well as your business, too, I miss the days when the guys could come out and involve themselves in the community. Can't do it no more. NASCAR won't let them. And and why? What happened now? I mean, James and his bunch they would come in, and all these guys, the the well, uh, Mayor Crown and James and, and Friend, they would come to your place starting Monday morning before the the and spend every night and come out 
our restaurant. Is they raced in town shack. for a week. They came in on Monday and stayed all week long, and yeah. all the hotels did good. The businesses did good, and next yes. thing you know, they won't let them go to the bars. And they upgraded NASCAR to be for the young yeah. superstars, and uh, the crowds went from 240-something thousand to 60-something, I think, before they've, they've got it back up again now, 100 maybe. So uh, they've had to take bleachers out of every track. Every track in NASCAR circuit took bleachers out. I just didn't and think that we're was We're talking right. racing. Randy, y'all kick off something here. We're about ready to go to the house. Oh, I tell you what, we done done it. Uh, you want to sing one until we get ready to go? We hope y'all enjoyed the show today. We're just talking, killing some time, and enjoying it. There's something to do. Hey! show today right here we got just a few seconds left we got a lot of great shows coming up we're going to be on the beach for about three days thursday friday and saturday here in a couple weeks we'll be streaming live through wac tv and facebook and all that stuff on the tv channel 24 we'll be live coming to you down there in south alabama we'll have our, we'll have our shorts on T-shirts. Absolutely. All Alabama. that kind of stuff. Got some great shows coming up here while we're in town, too. So don't forget it. We'll be on a little bit longer, so just hold on, y'all. It's all coming your way from right here in Talladega, Alabama. Bye-bye. We'll see y'all tomorrow morning. Oh, yeah.